Hey everybody, Joe the Lego Man here and I just want to give you a quick update on our Lego store set we got from the Legoland Discovery Center. So, uh, as you can see, I've mouse plated it and in the front there I put three parking spots. Now, they're not f the full spot. The width is what we're going to have but the depth isn't because we haven't placed it in the city yet. Uh, I decided to offset this one on the mills plate and I put a little flower bit off to the side. Now as you can see, this, this is how the set came. So originally the back part opened so basically the two hinge pieces at the bottom I took out, put a little grill as a connector there. So what I did to finish this off is I finished making the second floor and I also made a roof for it. So with it in place it's still a modular set as you can see. And I gave it a couple windows in the back there just to kind of match the first floor. You know, nothing too fancy as far as the roof goes. Maybe some of the uh, quarter fencing there along with the white roof. And some of the nice little archways to give it somewhat of a fancy look. Nothing too crazy there. As much as I like a lot of these sets, I don't like the open back so I'm I'm glad I was able to finish this off. Now let's place this in the city and see what it looks like. So the Lego store we decided to place in the same area as our friends' buildings are. Uh, there's a little bit more color here. It's a little bit more of a shopping district. Uh, we got a restaurant coming in. Now there's the location of the Lego store. Now the only thing I've noticed is there was a, one of the parking lots I built for the fire station. That's been pushed back as you can see. So what I'm thinking is going to happen now with the parking lot for the fire station along with the police station, I think they're going to be changing. I think I'm going to only going to make them a half base plate wide and kind of make them more like a drive in into the back. And as you can see with the Lego store, with the parking spots out in front, it comes pretty close to our sidewalk. So along with the half base plate of a driveway there. I'm going to be pushing these things back a half base plate as well. That way there's room for the cars to drive in and park, not impinging on the sidewalk. And I think eventually every building here will be pushed back that half base plate maybe to come for some parking, some other features. And there you have it. The Lego store placed in the Lego city. If you like it, subscribe, drop a comment, share it.